Well, so congratulations! Finally, we have our top two players entering our final. So we are reaching our final now. So again, congratulations, Alie, and congratulations, Anova, for reaching the final. So we shall start our final very soon. So Alie is ready. So we will be waiting for Anova for him to. Okay, so now never mind. He both plays ready, so we will be starting our final very soon. So let's go. Alie versus Anova may the best player wins. Let's go. So we have Arm Dragon versus our tier one hero. Let's go, Ikuzo. Whoa! So Arm Dragon is making his debut here. Whoa! Very nice. So let's go, Alie is starting his first round again. So Hero is starting his first round. Well, this is going to be a very tough moment. So now putting down the malicious and now we have the polymerizations activate. Then we will be going in with the dystopia. Okay, so dystopia activate, take out one card and now hit it with the 800. And now the malicious will summon down another malicious. Okay, so destiny effect activate. So we have a difference in the attack now. So now set one, set two, set three. Three back rows at the back. And then the decider will back back to the hand. So good, very good. So we have a very annoying first turn set up. Three cards at the back. So let's see what Anova is going to do now. Okay, so now hopefully that Anova doesn't break, but let's see what is the spicy he will bring. So take out one level five and he will bring in a level three. Okay, so he has one extra monster here and whoa, very good. One, two, three, shop, shop. Shuffle, shuffle. And now putting down the level 3 and now let's see what he going to do now. Okay, there's a long delay. Confirm there is something to be interrupted with but let's see what he going to do. So again everyone, now we are at our final. So we have Arm Dragon versus Hero. Okay, so now it's allowing the Arm Dragon activate sending the level 7 and it goes to level 5. Okay, so we have the level 5 arm dragons now. So again, level 7 arm dragons will get a level 10. But okay, they can send what if this card sent to the graveyard from the field to the graveyard. If you don't, if this card activate, you can add one arm dragon from your deck to the head. So this level 7 allows him to get one arm dragon to the head. Okay, very good, very good. So now he's getting the Dark Arm Dragon. Whoa, okay, he is coming in full force. So now he will activate the level 5 again. Let's see what he's doing. What he will be doing now. Okay. I think the RDA is also deciding what to do and now he's going with the Dark Arm Dragon first. Okay, so the Dark Arm Dragon can activate and destroy but still Dystopia should be interrupting it first. Let's see what he's going to do now. Okay. <clears throat> so Dystopia start out first. It protecting his own cards so well the dark arm dragon get destroyed without destroying anything so with this it reduce that and the white dragons activate sending it one two and then can summon down the white onto the field okay and with that he able to get a white veil Okay. So he still have 
three cards at the back to interrupt. So Arnova will need to be very calculative on his actions. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, come on, come on. What are Nova going to do now? Tough, tough. So now, on with the crackdown. So the crackdown will snatch over the white. Wow. And what are you going to do now? <clears throat> so now, the white bills activates. Okay, so he will be activating to equip with the level 5. We have still two more cards here. So now set one. Set two. Okay, so what I guess is that he doesn't have enough resource to throw. And now he go on with an unexpected die to destroy the level 5. And the white wheel will hit itself with 3k. Oh. So the first round wins goes to Alie. Start. Okay, so let's see how it goes now. Will we have some surprise in today's final? So now who will start first? Blue. So Anova will start his first turn. Okay, I so far still didn't see that how Arm Dragon perform on turn 1. But still, with that, he can proceed with his combo without any worries. He can still level up easily, okay, with that. So, let's see. But still, you need to know that it can have a quick effect destroyed. Very good. Okay, so now one, two, shuffle, shuffle, and now let's go. Set the monster. Wow. Okay, oh, okay, he's go on with the dark arm dragons. Set one. Wow, very bad. Oh, I thought that he will go level 3, level 5, level 7, level 10. At least that he can have that dark arm dragons. Uh, Arm Dragon Thunder level 10 on the field for further interruptions, but well, it doesn't. And now we have the Dark Arm Dragons on the field. Okay. Well, he breaks. Yes. I guess he breaks. Too bad, too bad. GGD. <laughs> Okay, unless the Alie is also break, then we might have the other way. Okay, but still the arm arm dragon breaks. If not, usually you will be seeing three, five, seven, ten, and we will be seeing these arm dragons on the field. But no, ouch. Okay, never mind. Let's see what Alie going to do now because that he been stopping for quite long. One card combo hard to break. Yes lah, but why taking Alie so long? Okay, because if he really has the card on his hand, right, he should not be delaying so long. And now he is taking his sweet time. Okay, so now he's going on with the Book of Moon first to flip down the Dark Arm Dragons. Okay, go, go, let's go. So, drill dark. <clears throat> set one, set two, set three. What the heck? Okay, so he instead he's doing the piercing. So book of moon again. Oh ah, oosh, ah ah ah! What the heck? What the heck? Oh ah! Are you bricks? Okay. So now back to Anova. Okay, he has two cards on his hand. Let's see, Unexpectable die, and he destroying the dark arm. Draw one. 
he DM I also not so sure leh. Okay, so now he has the white take out the white salmon down. Okay, and he getting the white veil. Okay, so white veil is a very dangerous card. Should not simply activate actually. Okay, so now let's see. Oh wow well, wow well, he has the level 3 but he doesn't active he doesn't proceed with the combo at the first start. So actually the Arnova didn't break but he putting hope on the next turn. You see? I'm not so sure. Okay, so now he has one card. So let's see if he can level up or not. Okay, let's see if he can level up or not now. Okay, what 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 what? Come on, come on. <clears throat> but this is a white veil. So on a hand to the graveyard. So I don't think that he has a monster. So practically that this level 3 mon level 3 nope. Attack. So crack down. It's taking over the white. Back to Aliye. Ah, what the heck? Oh, what the heck is this? GG. So, destiny effects. <clears throat> okay, so we have a polymerization here. So, malicious will get down another malicious. Okay. <clears throat> so, maybe there will be two heroes and maybe a polymerization is possible now. So, Ice Dragon Prison. Dark drill and now let's see whether lens is possible. So this is a polymerization. So this is expendable die, destroy. Okay, so still he be snatching over the dark drill. Okay, extra one cards destiny effects again. Return one banish, add one destiny hero. He's getting a plasma, so I guess that he can go on with the combo now. He has a polymerization on the field, so uh, sunrise, dystopia, or anything is possible now. So return. So malicious for another malicious. Sadly, not able to see Arm Dragon perform. So now he go off with the Cerberus. Cerberus will fling this card back. Whoa, crack down. Bro. Polly. Summon down the Dystopia and he wins. 2.8, 1.6 is a win. Three K, so direct attack one, and attack again. Boom! Congratulations, our winners for tonight again goes to Hero, and Alie wins. Congratulations, Hero make it as the champions tonight. Congratulations, Alie. Omedo, congratulations.